Hi, my name is Rachel and I would like to start out with my first uh, video in my Discover series and this is just a series of videos that I'm putting together to help people find coloring books that maybe they've never seen before. Now a lot of these coloring books have been out for, for, for years um, but that doesn't mean everyone's come across them so I'm going to kind of try to go through the ones that um, I don't see um, as many reviews for on Amazon and things like that. So the first one I'm focusing on here is the uh, Coco Wyo Publishing Company. Um, they have quite a few coloring books out already, but they're still relatively new, only within the last year or so. Um, so I'd just like to go through some of these coloring books for you. I do actually have uh, full flip-throughs of many of these books. I'll probably get all of them eventually um, for you to look at if you'd like to purchase them, because I like to see all the pictures in the book before I purchase them. So let me just start off here with this dinosaur book. Now they have several animal um, animal books in their library of, of available coloring books and uh, most of them are all of these kind of Zentangle animals. I'm not as big on the Zentangles myself so I probably won't be purchasing more of those. Um, I like the dinosaurs because, well I like dinosaurs and because with the, uh, the, the skin and the patterns and stuff you can kind of work with that. You don't necessarily have to color them like a, a lot of the Zentangle books get colored. So, lots of nice pages here. Really crisp lines, great detailing. So, this is probably a good book for people of a lot of different um, skill levels. Uh, I know that people that are n maybe more beginners don't always like the tiny um, the tiny spaces and detailing, but it actually it, it actually helps um, if you want to to uh, just start filling them in slowly a little bit at a time and not to get too intimidated by them. So that is their dinosaur book. They also have a couple of these animal, they've got the Animal Village one, they've got an Animal City one. I don't know if they're going to come out with more of those. And these ones are, um, I, I feel like they're a little bit anime inspired, uh, the kind of pictures they have kind of look like you could have an anime character in there, um, but they're just all animals in a village. Quite nice book, really. Lots of different kinds of scenes. So, these books are kind of your standard, standard size coloring book uh, for what's usually available. And then they also have several of these uh, time to travel baby, and then they have like uh, puppy, cat. Uh, this one happens to be llama, and this one's a really neat series that they they put out because it uh, showcases all sorts of places in the world to visit. So these are it's really cute, really cute. They've got the the little the little animal baby that's featured in every single picture, as if they're 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 on vacation. And they're taking pictures, and they've they've traveled all over the world. So another really cute one. Same again, same standard size. Now, one of the reasons I really like this company is because they've been doing some of these midnight these midnight books, which are books that um, they have the black around the image. So when you when, when you color these, um, you can really get that, that pop of contrast between bright color and the dark background without having to, uh, you know, spend all spend all your time trying to color in that background with a, a marker or paint, which can end up looking uneven and messy. So these um, these Midnight Series books, I've, I've really been enjoying it. And that's one of the reasons I, I started uh, buying some of the books from this, this company. And this one is a really excellent book. It's it's quite a thick book. It's actually not that expensive um, for the size. Plus uh, the fact that it not only is it the midnight picture, but then for markers and um, other bleed through, it's got the the black inked backed pages. So I mean, if you were to if you were to try and print this book out of a PDF this way, you'd be using an entire ink cartridge, I think, on this book alone. But um, so many different picture pictures in this one, um, varying levels of detail or or uh, theme. So this is a really great coloring book, I think, to try out try out techniques with the black background. 
then they have a couple more of these. This is also a midnight book. And these ones are, um, these ones are very, very detailed pictures, very beautiful. And they, I think they, I think they look absolutely wonderful with their, with the black background here. So these ones are really beautiful pictures. A little bit more, the, the other, the hundred midnight flowers book was more, more simplistic, maybe a variety, kind of like a, a good book to test out. Hey, I want to try out some, some different, um, techniques. And then you get to these books and hopefully you've already, you know, figured out how you want to do stuff. Cause these are some really beautiful, really beautiful pictures in this one. And then the butterflies, they also have, this one is the midnight garden. Um, and this one also, I love, oh, I love these backgrounds. Just beautiful backgrounds with that black ink. I'm, I'm, I'm really happy that some of these companies are, are turning to this midnight. Not not all of them do it, and some of them did a, a couple, and then they never made any more. But, but these are just, just amazing pictures that could really turn out really, really neat, depending on what uh, mediums are used and what colors are used and... But this book, this book is just fantastic. Just, just the most beautiful details here. So, so anyway, I do have flip-throughs of the three Midnight books so far, and I will probably get flip-throughs of the other ones um, if you want to see all the pictures in the books. Um, anyway, this is the Coco Wyo Publishing. Really neat, really neat books. Um, and they're actually really, really decent priced books. So uh, if you haven't had a chance to check out these, this company or any of these kind of coloring books, um, head to Amazon and I, I don't know if they sell them anywhere else, but, um, these are the print on demand Amazon books. So, so go ahead, uh, head over there and, and see, see if you like any of these. Anyway, that will be the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, if you have any suggestions for me on coloring books you'd like me to look at, uh, just leave a message for me in the comments and I'd be happy to take a look at them. Thank you very much. Have a great day.